Hey everyone, I wanted to make a quick video just to show you how to access um, content on Planning Center so you can learn it. So um, you can do it a couple different ways. First, you can do it through the plan that you're assigned to. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm playing drums this weekend. So I would, you know, if I clicked on the date of the plan that I'm assigned to, it would bring me to that plan. And then I can access um, the music through each individual song um, by actually hovering my mouse over the numbers, these little squares with numbers in them at the end of the name of the song, as you can see. So it will say the number of attachments in each song, and I can come right down here uh, and click and listen to different things, um, or I can actually click and download it. So if I wanted to download this PDF, I could just click and it would download it directly to my computer and then open it right up. So um, you can see you can listen to things, different MP3s or M4As, through the actual website by clicking this little speaker. Or if you click um, the, the link itself, if it's a, a file that can be downloaded, it will download it. If not, it will bring you to the the web page or you know wherever you need to go in order to access it so that's the first way to do it um, online the second way to do it is actually through the songs tab up here so if you click on the songs tab it will bring you to a list of every single song and you can go into each individual song and look at the content in there so for example um, you know we'll just look at line and the lamb here there's two different kind of links that you can click on one is the title of the song the other is the title of the arrangement for example if two different groups did the same song they would be two different arrangements but the same song as you can see here joy to the world is a song two different arrangements um, but ultimately you click on either the name of the arrangement or the name of the song if you click on the name of the song um, you can see the arrangements here on the left hand side and um, you got to make sure you click on the name of the arrangement otherwise you won't be able to see the content within it so title of the song and then who did the song and that'll bring you to all of the different content in here um, and then the same thing applies you can either click and play this in you know the same material uh, just laid out a little bit differently or download it as you can see with these icons here um, so those are the two different ways to get to content on the web application. Um, if you look at the mobile app, it is similar. Um, basically, again, you would go into the uh, plan that you're scheduled for. Um, and then you can get to it a couple different ways. You can either go to the order of service and then click on each song and look at the media and the files for each song and you can see everything here all the different videos and PDFs and mp3s or if you just want to get all of it in one place you can actually look at the attachments right here if you click on the attachments you can see all of these for you came to my rescue all of these for come thou fount and all of these for raised to life so they're kinda of all in one place they make a bit more sense if you look at them through the order of service page here so you can see the key attachments and the arrangement attachments additionally if you just want to look at any old song you can click on the options button here and go to the song section of the app and then this will be basically identical to what we were doing online um, again if I go down to same song line in the lamb if I can find it here click on line in the lamb it's going to ask me which arrangement do you want to look at just like we clicked on the arrangement over here click on the Bethel arrangement and then I can go to files and I can see all of the arrangement files meaning the arrangement is like all the original stuff so the original mp3 and then I can look at the different key files so the original is in the key of B so this mp3 would play in the key of B and then this mp3 is going to play in the key of A so that is it. That should uh, get you to all the content that you need in order to practice on your own or to specifically practice for a service.